Hello. I'm thinking about what to make. I've got lots of sparkly things. Look at these. Silver sparkles. They're my favourite. <laughs> and look at this. It's really sparkly. Now, little one, I wonder what we can make. Piece of string, piece of string, which hand is it in? Uh, string. Oh, string. <laughs> Clever palm. Try again. Piece of string, piece of string, which hand is it in? String. <laughs> oh, never mind, palm. Have another go. Piece of string, piece of string, which hand is it in? String. String. Ah, palm string now. <laughs> <laughs> Bimbo, chase palm. Oh, give me back my piece of string. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Pom. Hi, Bessie. Bye-bye, Bessie. Oh, uh, goodbye, Pom. <laughs> I was just coming to find you. Fimba, look! Uh, now, don't you want me to guess which hand it's in, Pom? No, 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 no. Fimba, look! This one! Look! Oh! Oh, gun gun! Oh, maybe it's in the other hand, Pom! No, 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 not there. Oh, oh well, never mind, Pom. Shall I have another go? No, Fimba. It's all gone. Oh, dear. Poor Pom. Pretty little one. Fie! 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 Pom, I think he's fine. Oh, hello, Pom. Oh, what have you found? <laughs> oh, no. Oh. oh, what did you find, Pom? I can't see anything in your hand. Oh, a shiny, sparkle, pretty thing. Oh, you found something shiny and sparkly. Like my sparkle. Yes. I wonder what it was you found. Oh, hello there, my beautiful lovelies. Oh, hello, Bessie. Hello, Bessie. I was just plumping my plumage when I thought I heard somebody say they'd found something. Yes, Bessie. Uh, Bomber, find a shiny sparkle. Ooh. Uh, oh. Oh, God. But when Bomb came to show me what she had found, there was nothing in her hand. It had gone. Gone. Oh, that's strange. I wonder what you found. <gasps> ah, look! Look! Oh, oh, look! Look! Oh, 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 oh. Is this what you found, Pom? Yes! It's snowing, isn't it beautiful? It's snow! Hi, <laughs> Snow! Hello, Snow! Sometimes 
when it's really cold, it snows. <sighs> Pretty. Look at those snowflakes falling to the ground. Snowflake sparkly. Oh, look, that's all sparkly too. Wonder what they're doing. He's putting on lots and lots of glue. <laughs> Dicky. <laughs> and she's spraying on sparkly paint. I think they're making their own special snowflakes. More glue. Oh, oh it's beautiful. And look, another beautiful snowflake. The snow doesn't last forever. When it gets warmer, the snow just melts away. Bye bye, snowflake. Sad palm. We can make a snowflake. Our very own snowflake. Oh, what a good idea, Flory. Oh, you can make one too, Palm. Right. Um folding. Oh, and now we have to rip it. <laughs> oh, look, Pom, our own snowflake. <gasps> Pom snowflake. <laughs> oh, oh, now we can put some sparkly on it. Oh, sticky, sticky. Sparkly. Oh, oh look, Betty. See how it shines. How shiny. Shiny, shiny. My, they're just fabulous. Well done, you two. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a little snowflake, watch me twirl. I'm a little snowflake, see me swirl. I twirl and I swirl and dance around. And then I float down to the ground. <laughs> a snowflake sparkles and it's ever so white A snowflake sparkles and it shines in the night A snowflake is wet and it doesn't last long You hold it in your hand and then it's gone Gone! I'm a little snowflake, <sighs> watch me twirl <sighs> I'm a little snowflake, <laughs> see me swirl I twirl and I swirl and I dance around Then I float down to the ground Oh, that was fun <laughs> Ooh. Oh, what was that? Um, what's that? Ooh. Oh, and there's another <laughs> oh, and another. <laughs> it's on me nose. <laughs> oh, it's very cold. <laughs> oh, I wonder. I wonder. I wonder if it could be snowing. <laughs> oh. Oh, it is! Well, tickle my tadpoles. It's snowing in Thimble Valley. Hooray! Hooray! Ooh, I must tell the others. Hooray! <laughs> hmm. I know that smell. It smells like snow. Ooh, I say. <laughs> oh, what fun! <laughs> oh, guess what, Rowley? <laughs> it's snow 
gooing rocket. Oh, yes, it is, Rowley. Goo. It's so exciting. Way. It's snowing. It's snowing. The north wind is blowing. Hey. <laughs> um. Oh, I bet you've got a story about snow, Rowley. <laughs> well, yes, I have actually, Rocket. How did you guess? <laughs> well, I'm good at guessing, Rowley. I am the guessing frog. <laughs> Shall I go and get the others? Yes. Why don't you do that, Rocket? And I'll be... Back in a Rowley Mo! <laughs> <laughs> When you take a look inside a book, it's fun as fun can be. Oh, now what have we here? When you take a look inside a book, who knows what you might see? A story or rhyme, just take the time to read along with me. Hey! It's story time, everyone! Oh, <laughs> good! Time for a story! And it's snowing! <laughs> oh, it's snowing! Hooray! Hey, hey, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> it's snowing! Snow! Snow! Oh, we know, Fimbo. Pom found a snowflake, and then it started to snow. And look! We made our own snowflake! Oh, that's lovely, Flory. Yes, it is. <laughs> oh, it stopped snowing now. Oh, hello there, everyone. Oh, oh, oh that was quick. Oh, what's that you've got there, Flory? We made a snowflake, Rowley. <laughs> I say, that is a very fine snowflake, Flory. <laughs> Can you guess what my story is about? Huh? No, Flake. That's right, Pom. A snowflake. Oh, Where's Rocket? Oh, it's not like him to be late. Oh, here I am, Rowley. I'm here. <laughs> Don't start without me. <laughs> of course not, Rocket. <laughs> now, are you sitting comfortably? Good. Then I'll begin. This story is called... Snowflake. Hmm. It was the coldest day of the year. The sky was white. The trees were white. The grass was white. Everywhere Snowflake looked was white. But Snowflake was very happy. All around her friends were dancing. Hello, hello, they shouted to Snowflake. Bump. Suddenly, Snowflake landed somewhere. She landed on something orange. It was a carrot. Someone was pushing the carrot into a big ball of snow for a nose. Then someone else added two big buttons for eyes. They were making a snowman. Snowflake could hear the children laughing and playing until it was time for them to go in. Then Snowflake heard a voice singing. It was the snowman. He was singing a happy song. Here I am again, uh, happy as can be, uh, with my snowflakes keeping me company. Snowflake looked up at the sun shining brightly in the blue sky. Soon she could feel herself sliding down the snowman's chin and onto his tummy. Oh dear, she said. It can't be time to go yet. I've only just got here. But then she melted onto the ground with a plop. The other snowflakes were falling too. Goodbye, goodbye, they said. See you next time it snows, said Snowflake. Ah, lovely. That's what happened to Pom Snowflake. Oh, what's that, Flory? Pom caught her snowflake in her hand yes. and then it melted. So when she opened her hand again, it wasn't there. <laughs> oh, kind. Oh, oh, I see. One moment it was there, the next moment it had gone. <laughs> <laughs> sing, sing. I'm a little snowflake, watch me twirl. I'm a little snowflake, see. Swirl. I twirl and I swirl and I dance around Then I float down 
to the ground. <laughs> a snowflake sparkles and it's ever so white. A snowflake sparkles and it shines in the light. A snowflake is wet and it doesn't last long. You hold it in your hand and then it's gone. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a little snowflake, watch me twirl I'm a little snowflake, see me swirl I twirl and I swirl and I dance around And then I float down to the ground oh, Come on everyone, sing along! <laughs> We're all little snowflakes, watch us twirl We're all little snowflakes, see us swirl We twirl and we swirl and we dance around Up and down and all around <laughs> You ones, look! Oh. Hello to you. How do you do? <laughs> oh, do you like my crown? I made it today at school. I stuck it together all by myself. Come on now, let's go and show Uncle Rolly. Ready? Then off we go! Whee! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, hello there. And how are you today? I'm just baking a very special cake for a very special person. I wonder if you can guess who it is. Hello, Uncle Rolly. Oh, hello there, little beau. I was just telling our friends that someone special is coming for tea today. Oh, who's coming for tea, Uncle Rolly? Well, see if you can guess. Will you give me a clue? <laughs> of course I will. I'll give you three clues. Oh, great! What's the first clue, Uncle Rolly? Uh, um, the first clue is... the colour blue. <gasps> like the jewels in my crown. Let's go and find Hugo and Migo. They can help us guess. Hugo! Migo! Wigo! Amigo! Let's a go go! Can you think of something blue? Hmm, <laughs> something blue? Something blue? Yes, something blue. Someone special is coming for tea, and we've got to guess who it is. Well, who is it? I don't know. We've got to guess. What's for tea? I don't know that either, but I'm sure it'll be something special. Come on then, let's guess! <laughs> Hello, hello, who do you think will come for tea? Is it you or is it me? Is it no or is it yes? Come on, Snoots, we've got to guess. Hello, hello, who do you think will come for tea? Is it you or is it me? Something blue like... It blue galoo! Do you think... Oh, we know who's coming to tea. Really? Who is it? Is it the Blue Galoo? Well, uh, no, it's not the Blue Galoo. Oh. Uh, shall I give you your second clue? Yes, yes please. please! Here goes then. Hop! Hop! Hop, hop! We've got to think of something that can hop. How are we going to do that then? Maybe my busy book can help. Busy book, busy book, let's take a look. Someone is hiding. Who can it be? Is it a thimble? Who can you see? It's Flory! We're looking for something that can hop. Can you help us? Oh, look, a rabbit. Can a rabbit hop? 
yes, a rabbit can hop. What else can hop? It's a horse. Can a horse hop? <laughs> no, the horse can't hop. But it can trot. That's a watering can. Can a watering can hop? No, the watering can can't hop. But it can water a flower and make it grow. Can you think of anything else that can hop? What's that? It's a kangaroo! A kangaroo? Yes! Can a kangaroo hop? It can! The kangaroo can hop. Hooray! How many things did we find that can hop? A kangaroo, one. And a rabbit, two. We found two things that can hop. Thank you, Flory. See you again soon! That's it. It's definitely a blue... Rabbit! No, a kangaroo. Hmm. I wonder. Do you think it's a blue kangaroo? I'm not sure. Hello. Hello. Who do you think will come for tea? Is it you or is it me? Is it no or is it yes? How much notes we've got to guess. Oh, oh, a blue kangaroo. Do you think it's a Is it you and it isn't me? And it isn't the friendly old blue balloon. Then it must be a very big blue kangaroo. A very big blue kangaroo? Ooh! A very big blue kangaroo, that's true. Come on, let's go and tell Roly. <laughs> ah, there you are again. This Time we know who it is. Oh, who is it? It's a blue kangaroo. A very big blue kangaroo. <laughs> I'm afraid you're still not quite right. Oh. Uh, would you like the last clue? Yes, yes please. please. <laughs> then I'll be back in a roly mo. <laughs> oh, story time with roly mo. Our, Our favourite time, time of day. day. <laughs> When you take a look inside a book, who knows what you will see? When you take a look inside a book, it's fun as fun can be. With cats and dogs and birds and frogs, a monkey who says boo. Ooh, wonderful things, and giants and kings, and maybe a thimble or two. Now what have we here? When you take a look inside a book, who knows what you might see? A story or rhyme, just take the time to read along with me. Hmm. Books over here, books over there. Find me a book with a story to share. A book that will give us the last clue, if you please. Ah, thank you. Now then. Are you all sitting comfortably? Yes! Good. Then I'll begin. Hmm. The princess didn't have many friends to play with, and so she had lots of time to practice her juggling, and she was very good at it. In fact, the princess was so good at juggling that she wanted to be the best juggler in the whole kingdom. One day, she was juggling her golden balls. She juggled one, then two, then three, four, and five balls. Suddenly, splosh! One of the balls fell into the pond. Oh, what am I going to do? She said. Don't worry, said a voice. The princess looked round and saw a little frog. I will swim down and get it for you, he said. But if I do, then every day you must come down to the pond and juggle for me. You are completely crackers, said the princess. But she agreed to do as he asked. So the frog swam down into the pond and fetched the ball. 
And, true to her word, every day the princess came to the pond and juggled her balls, and the frog laughed and clapped. One day, the king held a juggling competition at the palace. The princess was so busy juggling and showing off and winning prizes that she forgot her promise to the little frog. The frog got fed up with waiting, so he hop, hop, hopped all the way to the palace to find her. The princess was juggling ten bananas when in hopped the frog. She was so surprised that the bananas all fell down splat. The king was cross that the princess had not kept her promise, and so he took away the golden balls and said, No more juggling. The frog didn't like to see the princess unhappy, so he said to the king, I am the world-famous pie-spinning frog. If I show you my pie-spinning trick, will you give the golden balls back to the princess? Bring some pies, said the king, who did so love to see a new trick. Let the pie-spinning begin. So the frog spun a blackberry pie on his foot, a strawberry pie on his head, and an apple pie in each hand. Magnificent, said the king, and he gave the princess back her balls. The princess was so pleased that she kissed the frog. And the frog turned into a handsome prince. From that day on, the princess and the frog prince were best friends. Every day they juggled and span lily leaves and lived happily ever after. There, that's your third clue. <laughs> oh, I think I can smell my very special cake. I'd better hurry and get it out of the oven. <laughs> I think we know who's coming for tea now, don't we? Yeah! <laughs> Do we? Yes! Hello! Hello! Now we know who's coming for tea. It isn't you and it isn't me. We all tried our best and we had a guess. And it was quite hard, we must confess. And now we know. We know who's going to come for tea. We know he's blue. Not like and we know he can really, really hop it. There's only one person it's got to be. A, a prince. <laughs> a prince? Yes, a prince. Yippity dippity! Yippity ba 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 Prince! But you go, me go. Hippity hoopity hoo, how'd you diddly do? It's Rocket! Of course it's Rocket. We've got to tell him. Yes, we've got to smell him. I mean, tell him. Tell him what? A prince is coming for tea. Hey, <laughs> have I missed something? No, you're just in time for tea, Rocket. Yummity yum! Ooh, a red carpet. Who's that for? It's for... The, the Prince! prince. Um, the Prince? Yes, a prince is coming for tea. Wow, how exciting! <laughs> <gasps> oh, here he comes now! <laughs> oh, Rocket! You're here already. It's Rocket. Yes, yes, we know it's Rocket. No, it's Rocket who is coming to tea. <gasps> Think about it. He's blue. He's the best hopper in Thimble Valley. And Rowley's story was about a frog. <gasps> but what are we going to do? Leave it to me. So, uh, when's the prince getting here, eh? The prince? Rocket, can I give you a kiss? Uh, well, uh, yes, of course you can. Um, maybe I'll turn into a prince. That's um. the idea. <laughs> oh, thank you. I oh, thank you. Hooray! <laughs> prince Rocket. Now, um, is any of that apple crumble cake for me? <laughs> well, we've had a good guessing day today. Yes, yes, it's been, been a roly moly day. Oh, you will come and join us next time in Fimble Valley, won't you? Now it's time for us all to go. Cheerio! 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 Oh, hello. Who are you? I'm Fimbo. How do you do? I like playing. What about you? I like playing. Do you too? Oh, but. I'm really very busy, so 
much to do today. I have so many things to do, but there's still time to play. Ah, oh, but... I'd like to stop just now and then and with my shimmy shaker. Shimmy, shimmy, shake, shake, shake. Shimmy, shimmy, shake. But I'm really very busy, so much to do today. I have so many things to do, but there's still time to play. But there's still time to play, so much to do today. Hooray! Uh, boo! <laughs> hello, little one. Oh, hello. Did I give you a surprise too? Shall I do it again? <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, <boo. laughs> oh. oh, oh, I'm getting the bimbling feeling. I'm going to find something. <laughs> Twinkling, I can hear a sound. It's telling me there's something waiting to be found. Where is it? Where is it? What could it be? I think it might be over there. Let's go and see. Oh, there is something to be found here. But where is it? Is it over here? No. Or is it over there? Oh, oh can you see it anywhere? Um, oh! <laughs> What's that? <laughs> oh, it's very crinkly. Oh, hello, Flurry. <clears throat> What's that? Oh, I've just found it, Rocket. It's all wrapped up. Oh, it looks very special. Yes, I think it's a special present. A, a special present? Oh, hello, Flurry. <laughs> Hmm, that looks exciting. I wonder what it could be. Oh, 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 is it a ball to play with? <laughs> no, Rocket. <laughs> I don't think it's a ball. It's very light. Maybe it's a bubble. What's in here? What can it be? All wrapped up so carefully. Whatever it is, it's round and light. Maybe inside it's shiny and bright. It'll float right up. Top of the tree, a bubble's what I'd like it to be. What's in here? What can it be? All wrapped up so carefully. Whatever it is, it's round and round. It flies in the air without a sound. I'm sure we're going to find out soon what I'd really like it to be a balloon. <laughs> oh, hello there, everyone. Hello, Rolly. Look what I found. Oh, well, that's a splendid present you've got there. What do you think is inside it, Rolly? Well, now, let me see. Do you think it might be a hat? <laughs> <laughs> a hat? <laughs> I think it might be a bubble. Thimble wants it to be a balloon. Uh, it's a ball. That's what it is. It's a ball. <laughs> well, I think the best thing about presents is always the surprise. Oh. It's wrapping paper. They're going to wrap something up. <laughs> I wonder what's inside the box. Oh, they're sticking the paper together with sticky tape. Hmm. Wrapping a present can be quite tricky. You need to hold the paper tightly. And then stick on the sticky tape as quickly as you can. They're doing very well. That's one side done. And now the other side. Fold the paper. Hold it tight. <laughs> and on with the sticky tape. 
Ooh, that looks tippity toppity, doesn't it? Oh, that's going to be a nice surprise for someone. We've got a surprise present. Shall I open it? Shall I? Oh, yes! Oh, yes! Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> um, what's in it? What's in it? What's in it? <laughs> oh. 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 Oh, oh, there's nothing inside it. Well, I must say, that is a surprise. <laughs> oh, no present. Nothing at all. Oh, yes, there is, Fimbo. Look, there's my pretend ball. Oh, yep. Up it goes, and down, oh. and up and down. Oh. <laughs> a pretend ball. A ball you can't see. Oh, that's right. Oh, off it goes. I'll just go and chase my ball. Bye. No, there's nothing here. Oh, well now, Flory, I wouldn't say that. You have got something, haven't you? Have we? Um... Oh, yes! The paper! <laughs> That's right. Beautiful wrapping paper. <laughs> oh, Fimbo, why don't we make a surprise present for someone? Good idea. Um, who? Oh, 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 I know. What about Bessie? Yeah, Bessie. Let's make a surprise present for Bessie. Now, we've got to think of what to do with it. Oh... <sighs> Hey, look, Flory, there's a picture on one side of this wrapping paper, but there's nothing on the other side. Oh, well, that's right. I think I've got an idea for my surprise present. See you later, Flory. Oh, bye, Fimbo. I think I'll go and see if Pom wants to help me. Hmm. Now, what can I give Bessie as a surprise? Hmm. Oh, I know. I'm sure Bessie would like a surprise story as a present. <laughs> I'll go and have a look. I think I know just the one. Hmm. Mom! Mom! Hi, Flory! Look what I found, Pom. Oh. It's wrapping paper. Oh, hello, wrapping paper. We're going to give Bessie a present. Huh? Can you think of anything to give her, Pom? Oh, uh, a Bessie pebble. Oh, that's a good idea. Uh, um, a Bessie leaf. Oh, and a leaf. Yes. Oh, do you think we can wrap these up? Uh, uh, Pom, wrap, um, uh, uh, oh. Oh, maybe we don't need anything inside the paper. Maybe we could do something with the paper. Oh, a pomno, pomno, on your head. Oh, that's a good idea. Uh, a paper hat. Yes. Oh, let's make a paper hat for Bessie. Oh. <laughs> ah, <laughs> I thought the paper would come in useful. <laughs> yes, we're making a paper hat for Bessie. Yes. Oh, what a good idea. Well, I thought I might tell her a surprise story. <laughs> What do you think? Oh, Dory, Dory. <laughs> yes, Pom. I've been trying to choose just the right one. Oh, but it's very difficult. Uh, uh, Bessie surprise. Oh, can we help you choose, Rolly? Of course you can, Flory. <laughs> now, uh, shall we have a story about a surprise visitor or a surprise birthday present? Oh, a present. Oh, yes, a surprise birthday present, please. <laughs> right oh, I'll go and fetch it right away. <laughs> Back in a roly mo. <laughs> There, a hat for Bessie. Books over here, books over there. Everywhere when you take a look inside a book, it's fun as fun can be. Oh, now what have we here? When you take a look inside a book, who knows what you might see? A story or rhyme, just take the time to read along with me. Here we are. Oh, we finished our hat now, Rolly. Look, 
What do you think of it? Oh, jolly good. Shall we go and surprise Bessie then? <laughs> There we are. There's some snow falling. Hmm. Now for some nice red berries for the birds to eat. <laughs> now, let's see. I've got a wintry tree, some red berries, a blue sky and snow. Now, all it needs is some winter sparkle. <laughs> First, some glue. There we are. And now for some glitter. <laughs> right, are you ready? Here we go. Shakey, shakey, shake. <laughs> Finished. Hmm. Let's go and find Bessie. And uh, one and two and two and three and in out out and stretch up high. Oh, oh! I do find a few exercises make me feel fresh, fluffed up, and ready for anything. Oh, Bessie, Bessie! Oh, Bessie! Oh, hello there, my beautiful lovelies. I was just wondering where you'd got to. <laughs> Hello, Bessie. Oh, hello, Rolly. We've got a surprise present for you. Oh, oh, oh. Have you, Chuckies? Well, that's very exciting. Bessie hat. Yes, Bessie. We made it for you. Oh, 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 well, flap me wings. Would you believe it? A new hat for an old bird. Oh, oh, oh. Thank you so much. Oh, Bessie, Bessie, I've got a surprise present for you too. <laughs> Anybody would think it was my birthday today. Another lovely surprise. Oh, shall I open it for you, Bessie? Oh, would you be so kind, Fimbo? I can't wait to see what's inside. <laughs> oh, well, just look at that. Oh, yes, it's a winter picture, Bessie, with lots of sparkle. Oh, it's fabulous, you clever chap. I shall treasure it. Well, he's got a surprise for you too, Bessie. Oh, well, yes. I thought you might like a story. Oh, Rolly, I'd love a story. <laughs> but I won't tell you the end. It's a surprise. <laughs> <laughs> now then, shall I begin? This story is called A Birthday Surprise. It was the end of summer, but the sun was still shining brightly. Happy birthday, Molly, said Gran. But it's not my birthday for ages, said Molly. Inside the present was a big bowl of brown earth. Give it plenty of water, said Gran. It's your birthday surprise. Put it in the spare room, said Mum. It'll get lots of sunshine there. So Molly put the bowl on the windowsill of the spare room. She watered it and she waited. But nothing happened. Autumn came. Outside, the leaves were falling off the trees. Molly gave the bowl some more water. She waited and she waited, but still nothing happened. Winter came. Snowflakes fell on the frosty ground. Molly watered the bowl again. She waited and she waited and she waited, but still nothing happened. Molly forgot all about the bowl of earth. She didn't even go to look at it. But Mum remembered. Then it was spring. Time for the flowers and leaves to grow again. And time for Molly's birthday. Gran came for tea. Do you like your birthday surprise? She said. Molly looked puzzled. The one I gave you last summer? Molly ran as fast as she could to the spare room. The bowl wasn't just full of brown earth anymore. It was a bowl of beautiful golden yellow flowers. And there were four of them. Four daffodils, because you're four years old today, said Gran. The flowers have been asleep in the earth all this time. But now it's springtime. They've grown into your birthday surprise. Oh, thank you, Gran, said Molly. That really was a birthday surprise. Ah, lovely. A surprise story, Bessie. Oh, well, 
this has been a very special day. <laughs> a surprise day. That's right, Flurry. And now there are no more surprises. Oh. <laughs> 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 oh, see, Thimbo, there's always a surprise when Rocket's around. <laughs> 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 Today is a special day for me With surprises, one, two, three Rolly's story was just right Thimble's picture sparkling bright Florrie and Pom made me this hat Thank you so much, I really love that <laughs> We have had a special day yes. With surprises all the way My surprise was when I found A present oh so big and round It wasn't a balloon, a bubble or a ball Hello to you. How do you do? I'm a little bit late today. I was so busy playing with Baby Mo that I didn't know it was time to go and see Uncle Roly. Ready? Then off we go! Whee! <laughs> <laughs> oh, hello there. And how are you today? I'm just looking for Mego. I don't suppose you've seen him anywhere, have you? Woohoo! Oh. oh, I thought I heard something. Where can Mego be? Hmm. I'll go and look in the bedroom again. <laughs> Hello, Mego. Uh, shh! I'm not here. Yes, you are. No, I'm not. Are you playing hide and seek? Rub a dub dub. <gasps> scrub a dee scrub. You go. Mego? Mego? Amigo? Mm -hmm. Hello, Yuko. Oh, hello, little Bo. I'm looking for something. Mego? No, Rolly's looking for me go and I'm looking for my rubber duck. Hmm, not here. I'll go and look in the kitchen. <laughs> it must be bath day today. Yes, it is. That's why Uncle Rolly is looking for you and Hugo is looking for his rubber duck. Yes, it is. Rubber dub dub. Oops. Rubber dee scrub. Uh, my rubber duck's not in the kitchen. Oh, you love baths, don't you, Hugo? Oh, yes, it is. Yes! Rubber dub dub, scrub a dee scrub. I love bathing in my tub. Rubber dub dub, scrub a dee scrub. I hate bathing in a tub. <laughs> Come on, everyone. I'm going to look for my duck in the hallway. Rub a dub dub, scrub a dee. I really don't like baths, little Bo. But baths make you clean, so you don't smell. <laughs> I don't smell. <laughs> I know you don't, but you might do if you don't have a wash. Look. Busy buck, busy buck. Let's take a look. <laughs> Someone is hiding. Who can it be? Is it a thimble? Who can you see? It's Flory! What are we going to do today, Flory? Look, a cake! Yummity yum! Cake! 
cakes smell good. Oh, a rose. Roses smell lovely too. That's a sock. I wonder if it's a smelly sock. Oh, there's a bar of soap. I wonder what that smells like. Soap smells good. This is an odd one out game. Do you know which is the odd one out? Is it the cake? Or the rose? Or maybe the soap? Is it the smelly sock poo? <laughs> yes! All the other things smell nice and the sock smells yucky. Well done. There's a drum! And they look like symbols. That's a washing machine. Washing machines make our clothes clean. And that's a triangle. Do you know which is the odd one out? Is it the drum? Or the symbols? Or the triangle? Is it the washing machine? That's right. All the others are musical instruments, but the washing machine isn't. Well done. Look, this sock is having a wash. <laughs> yes, and it'll smell lovely when it's washed. Bye-bye, Flory. See you again soon. Scrubbity scrub, I like bathing in my tub. Uh-oh! Come on, everyone, let's... Well, my rubber duck isn't in the hallway. Have you looked everywhere? Yes, I have. I've looked in the kitchen and the living room and the hallway. And the slide and in the useful chest and the mending box and under the red fluffy puffs in the garden and I've asked the dizzy dollies and I've looked under the bed and in the fridge and behind the sofa and under the chair. I've looked everywhere. <laughs> Have you looked in the bathroom? The bathroom? No, I haven't looked in the bathroom. Do you think I should? Yes, definitely. I'll do that. Thanks, little Bo. Oh, there you are, Uncle Roly. Oh, hello there, little Bo. It's bath time, but I can't find Migo. Do you know where he is? Uh, well, not right now, Uncle Roly, but I've got an idea. Oh, what's that, little Bo? I think that you should read Hugo a story in the bath. A story? Yes. Can you read the one about the tiger who couldn't see his tail? Oh, yes. That's one of Migo's favourite stories, isn't it? Yes, it is. Hmm. I see. Well, then, I'll be back in a roly mo. <laughs> Just think, Migo. Story time with roly mo. Hmm. My favourite time of day. <laughs> See you in a roly mo, Migo. Hmm. I really want to listen to that story, but how can I? When you take a look inside a book, who knows what you will see? When you take a look inside a book, it's fun as fun can be. With cats and dogs and birds and frogs A monkey who says boo Boo! Wonderful things And giants and kings And maybe a thimble or two Now what have we here? When you take a look inside a book Who knows what you might see? A story or rhyme Just take the time to read along with me Books over here, books over there. Find me a book with a story to share. One of Migo's favourite stories, if you please. Ah, thank you. Splish, splash. Oh, I love baths. They are yummy, scrummy, delicioso. <laughs> <laughs> yes, they are. <laughs> rub a dub dub. Scrub a dee scrub. I love bathing in my tub. Come on, everyone, let's splash, splash, splash. There's nothing to beat. A really good wash. Oh. Ah, here we go. 
<laughs> now then, are you splashing comfortably? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Good. Then I'll begin. Hmm. Sunil the tiger cub loved to play coconut football with his friends Jip and Jamila. He loved jumping over puddles, and he loved chasing his tail. The one thing he didn't love was having his hair combed. Every day, Sunil's mum combed his hair before he could go out to play. Every day, Sunil wriggled and jiggled so much that the comb pulled at his hair. If you don't comb your hair, Sunil, said mum, it will get so tangled up, you won't even be able to see your tail. One morning, Sunil woke up early. When Mum told him he could go out to play, he ran out into the sunshine, calling for Jip and Jamila. But he didn't wait until his hair was combed. He hadn't gone very far when his hair fell into his eyes and whoops! He dropped his football. I'll find it later, he thought. Soon he came to a big puddle. Sunil was usually good at jumping over puddles, but this time his hair flopped into his eyes and... Splash! He landed right in the middle. Oh dear, laughed Jamila. You're all wet. Come on, cried Jip. Come and play Chase Your Tail. Sunil started to spin round and round, but he couldn't see his tail because his hair was in his eyes. He spun faster and faster, but it didn't help. You need your mum to comb your hair, chorused Jip and Jamila. Sunil's mum gave him a big cuddle. Can you comb my hair, mum? asked Sunil. This time Sunil sat very still. He didn't wriggle or jiggle and it didn't hurt at all. There, said Mum. Now you can see your tail. Thanks, Mum, said Sunil. And he played with Jip and Jamila till the sun went down. There. Ooh, do you think that worked? Uh-oh! Oops! Oh! Did you hear that? It sounded like my rubber duck. It was your rubber duck. Migo found it. Oh, thank you, Migo. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You're getting me all wet. Oh, sorry, Migo, but I'm so happy. Oh, look at that. Pretty. It's a bubble. I've got lots of them. Look. Oh, lots of bubbles. You can have some too if you want. Look at all these bubbles. <laughs> what? You're in the bath. Eh? No, I'm not. I'm in a bubble bath. And I love it! <laughs> you go! Me go! We go! Amigo! Ready? Ready! Rap a tap tap, scrub the de scrub. I love bathing in a tub. Come on, everyone, let's splish, splash, splosh. Haven't we had fun today? Yes! It's, it's been, been a rolly molly day! day. <laughs> you will come and join us next time in Fimble Valley, won't you? Now it's time for us all to go. Cheerio! Cheerio! Cheerio.